If only you knew the incredible power of starting your day with prayer. If only you knew that burdens are lifted, blessings are unlocked, and an abundance of breakthroughs are released when you tarry with the Lord in prayers. Didn't the scripture tell us that the prayer of a righteous person is powerful and effective? Imagine gaining direct access to God's throne of grace and having the key to unlock divine blessings, tremendous miracles, outstanding breakthroughs, unprecedented healings, and overwhelming abundance. Join me in this powerful morning prayer and discover the profound impact your prayers will make. Let us come together to seek God's favor and protection every morning and experience His miraculous hand guide us through each day, my beloved friends. Today we come together to commune with our Heavenly Father through a powerful morning prayer. Each sunrise comes with new opportunities, fresh perspectives, and unique situations. As humans, we lack the power to foretell the occurrence of each day or how the day will end. Only the one who knows the end from the beginning, our God, the Almighty, has such power. That is why we need to pray and commit our ways into the hands of the Lord early in the morning. Starting our day with prayer is a wonderful way to unlock the numerous blessings that God has in store for us. Looking at the scripture, we can see numerous instances where early morning prayers played a crucial role in the lives of believers. In the book of Psalm, chapter 5, verse 3, David says, In the morning, Lord, you hear my voice. In the morning, I lay my requests before you and wait expectantly. This shows the importance of seeking God's presence at the very start of our day, bringing our requests to Him with an expectant heart. The Lord hears us loudly and clearly when we pray to Him. His ears are not deaf or tired of listening to our prayers, so we have no reason to grow weary in prayers. Another scripture that talks about the blessings of morning prayer is Lamentations chapter 3, verses 22 to 23. It says, Because of the Lord's great love we are not consumed, for His compassions never fail. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. Indeed, we have a loving God who is compassionate about us. As His children, He cares deeply about us and longs to hear our voices each day. No matter what challenges we faced yesterday, today is an opportunity to experience His grace anew. God is ever ready to release upon us blessings, healings, breakthroughs, abundance, and miracles. There is something peculiarly common among believers of today. Due to our fast-paced lives, it is easy to rush into the day without pausing to connect with God. However, taking a few moments each morning to pray can make all the difference in your life. Prayer impacts on our spiritual well-being. Prayer gives us the confidence and assurance that God is with us. It sets the tone for the day, aligning our hearts with God's will and inviting His blessings and guidance into our lives. Consider the words of Isaiah 50 verse 4, which say, The Sovereign Lord has given me a well-instructed tongue to know the word that sustains the weary. He wakens me morning by morning, wakens my ear to listen like one being instructed. If you find it hard to pray, this scripture is for you. Even as we pray this morning, take this scripture to the Lord and ask Him to wake you in the morning. You need to be attuned to God's voice each morning, receiving His wisdom and instruction for the day ahead. Have you read the book of 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 16 to 18? In that scripture, the word of the Lord says, Rejoice always, pray continually, give thanks in all circumstances, for this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus. Here the Bible admonishes us to pray continually, not scantily, not whenever we feel like it, not whenever we are chance to pray, Having a consistent pattern of prayer not only helps you to draw close to God, but also gives you the key to unlock abundance, breakthroughs, and miracles 
in every ramification of your life. The Bible says that when we draw close to God, He will draw close to us. Today, we will pray for God's blessings to be unlocked in our lives, asking Him to guide our steps, provide for our needs, and protect us from harm. This prayer is meant to help you feel deeply connected to God, reminding you that His presence is with you every moment of the day. As we pray together, let us open our hearts to God's presence, trusting that He hears our prayers and responds with His abundant love and grace. Let us seek His blessings with faith, knowing that He is a generous and loving Father who delights in giving good gifts to His children. As Proverbs 8 verse 17 reminds us, I love those who love me, and those who seek me find me. By seeking God each morning, we position ourselves to receive His love and blessings greatly. Let us make it a daily habit to turn to Him first, unlocking the blessings and miracles that He has prepared for us. Now let us open our hearts and minds to pray this powerful morning prayer, inviting God's power to rest upon us and seeking His divine blessings for the day ahead. Stay with us until the end to allow your hearts to receive the full blessings of this blessed prayer from Jesus. I encourage you to say this prayer daily to see God's work in your life. To our wondrous, sovereign, living, loving God, let us pray. Our righteous and everlasting Father, King of the universe, we come before you this morning with hearts filled with gratitude and reverence. Our hearts are overflowing with the love and kindness that you have shown us and keep showing us. Each day, your mercy goes before us and your grace rests upon us to make the day smooth. Lord, we cannot take all your blessings for granted. Hence, we have come to thank you. We deeply appreciate the battles you have fought for us and how you made a way even in seemingly insurmountable situations. You have proved your love for us in more ways than we can count. For all these and more we say, thank you, dear Lord. As the dawn breaks and a new day begins, we seek your presence and guidance. We know that you know the end from the beginning, so we come before you hoping that you take absolute control of our lives. We commit the activities of today to your mighty and able hands. We submit to your leadership and ask you to direct us. Direct us, Lord, in all that we will be doing today. Direct our movements and give us fresh ideas to increase our productivity for today. Gracious Lord, we acknowledge that you are the source of all blessings. You told Abraham that in blessings you shall bless him. Father, we are descendants of Abraham. Therefore, release your blessings upon us mightily that the whole world may see it. As we begin this day, we ask for your divine favor and protection over our lives, our families, and our loved ones. No matter the amount of security we may think we have, you are the one who is the ultimate protector. That is why your word says that if the Lord does not watch the city, the watchers watch but in vain. Holy Father, we ask that your spirit brood over us and shield us from all evil. We also pray for your guidance and wisdom as we face the tasks and decisions before us. As your word says in James chapter 1, verse 5, If any of you lacks wisdom, you should ask God, who gives generously to all without finding fault, and it will be given to you. Grant us the discernment to make choices that honor you and reflect your love and truth. Help us, Lord, and give us the grace to please you in our words and actions. Give us the insights needed to fulfill our jobs, academics, and other aspects of our lives. Lord, we ask for your peace to fill our hearts and minds. As Philippians chapter 4, verses 6 and 7 remind us, Do not be anxious about anything but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. And the peace of God, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. 
we ask that you replace our anxieties and fears with your calming assurance, reminding us that you are in control. We hand over all our burdens to you in exchange for blessings and breakthroughs. Father, we pray for strength and courage to face the challenges of this day. Empower us with your Holy Spirit and give us the resilience to overcome obstacles as well as the perseverance to keep moving forward. Remind us that with you by our side, we can do all things. For the book of Philippians chapter 4 verse 13 says, I can do all things through him who gives me strength. We also pray for your provision, Lord. You are Jehovah Jireh, our provider and we trust in your faithfulness to meet all our needs. Help us to rely on you and not on ourselves. Father, open the floodgates of heaven and let it rain miracles, divine provision, blessings, and an abundance of opportunities. We pray for as many that are in need that you provide for them according to the desires of their heart. As we make efforts to make money, Lord, Bless the work of our hands. May our investments yield enormous dividends. May we not labor and another reap, but rather we shall eat the fruits of our labor. Father, we ask for your healing upon everyone who is suffering from one infirmity or another. Let your hand of healing rest upon their bodies, minds, and spirits. For those of us who are struggling with pain, both physical and emotional pain. We pray for your miraculous healing and restoration. Your word says in the book of Jeremiah, chapter 30, verse 17, But I will restore you to health and heal your wounds, declares the Lord, because you are called an outcast, Zion for whom no one cares. Father, may you take away sickness from the midst of your people and restore our health to perfection. We command cancer of any kind and in any location to come out now in the name of Jesus. Release your healing and miracle upon us this day. Lord, we pray for breakthroughs in every ramification of our lives. Let our lives be evidence to the world that you are good. Let there be uncommon miracles amongst us. May you break protocols and create new dimensions for our sake. Guide our steps, direct our paths, and help us to walk in obedience to your will. May our actions, words, and thoughts bring glory to your name. Help us to be conscious that we carry your presence in every moment, to seek your face continually, and to live in a way that honors you. As we draw strength from your word, let us remember the assurance found in Isaiah chapter 41, verse 10, which says, So do not fear, for I am with you, do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. These words remind us that we are never alone and that you are always with us, ready to support and uplift us. Your word says that you have not given us the spirit of fear, but of power, of love, and a sound mind. Hence we cast away every spirit of fear, doubt, or anxiety, trying to suppress our faith in you. Father God, take such away from us this day. May we continually rest in the assurances of your word as it builds our faith to face every challenge. Lord, just as the apostles prayed, we pray now that you increase our faith in you. Help us to lean on you and hope on you as you hold the final say over every situation that we may find ourselves in. Father, we also lift our communities, countries, and even the world at large into your powerful hands. We ask that your peace shall reign in the hearts of all people. Give our leaders the wisdom and insight to rule us. May they rule us by your word. As many nations that would be holding their elections soonest, we pray, Lord, that your will shall be done. The Bible says that when the righteous is on the throne, the people rejoice. Therefore, we pray that you unseat every unrighteous ruler in every country and put the righteous to rule in every nation. 
that your people may rejoice indeed. We also pray for your protection over our families and friends, asking that you keep them safe and secure. Surround them with your love and grace, and let your presence be a constant source of comfort and strength in their lives. Help us to be instruments of your peace wherever we may find ourselves. Lord, we ask for your blessing over our work and all our endeavors today. May everything we do be done for your glory and according to your will. Give us the creativity and inspiration to excel in our tasks and the humility to acknowledge that all our successes come from you. We pray for abundance in our lives, Lord. May you give us double blessings for every trouble we have ever encountered. We ask for your intervention in areas where we have struggled and where we need your divine touch. Open doors that have been closed and make a way where there seems to be no way. Let your miracles manifest in our lives, demonstrating your power and love for us. As we close this prayer, we are confident that you have heard and answered us according to your word. We completely trust that you can do all we have asked of you. We give you thanks, Heavenly Father. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory for all eternity. Thank you, Lord, for listening and answering my prayer. In the mighty, precious, and powerful name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Type the words. Praise Jesus in the comments if you feel this prayer has blessed you. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I proclaim all these prayer blessings cover you. I urge you to say this prayer daily to see God's work in your life. Share with us your testimonial when God works in your life in the comments so others will be inspired by the Lord's work. You can help us reach even more people and help spread the gospel by sharing this video with a family member or friend. And remember to subscribe and like our videos to reach others. Our channel, Power Prayers for Jesus, will keep you uplifted and help your relationship with the Lord. Leave any prayer requests below so our Holy Family can pray for you. Additionally, others on this platform and globally seeing this can pray for you. All glory belongs to God alone. May the amazing grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ dwell within each of you.